everyone and uh, my basic vision of uh, Nights at Freddy's like game made in Unity 3D so let's just say it's our bear Freddy I know I'm not good at modeling but you know I made this model within five minutes or maybe seven so this is a Freddy bear yeah whatever uh, I have it done so you know I made this simple model just for test and also I made a um, project called Unity 3D Five Nights at Freddy's and this is a very basic project very basic it's really you know it's really bad made uh, you know atmosphere here it's really really you know it's uh, like work in progress so let's just start with uh, with pressing this wonderful button play so here we go we have here our mm, our iPad or whatever I don't know what really it uh, it's, it's it looks like you know just a screen or maybe a, I know a laptop or what is it I don't know so so here we have uh, four rooms. So here we are in this room. We press the, uh, this button. We uh, holster our laptop or our screen. Press it again. Here we are. Our screen uh, it's right here again. We press it. We open this door. Open this door. Lights on. Lights off. Yeah. Lights off. Lights on. Uh, so here we will have you know mm, the battery. Mm, uh, like you know, mm, uh, that will be uh, dry, uh, draining. Uh, while we will be using this power here, you know, to close doors to keep it, you know, closed. Also, let's just switch camera number n n number three. We go back number two, and here we go. Camera number one. Freddy is over here. So keep your eyes open. He is. His mouse is his is, is going to eat you. So you can see he's very ugly. You he's not like monster. He's like you know bad modeled bear. <laughs> Look at his teeth. Okay, whatever. So let me uh, show you the code. So here we have very simple uh, you know project. I mean you know mm, map not map you know uh, scene yeah. So here we have you know um, let me introduce you to this basic um, basic um, set of this you know of cubes and planes over here so everything here is like a plane or box so the plane and box here we have uh, light sources over here here we have you know uh, two buttons here and two buttons here and also th th this is a door it's a simple cube yeah, not box, I mean cube, cube and planes. This is our bear made in the 3ds Max within uh, 7 minutes. And this is a, a cylinder I made, you know, inside just for test. And this is it. That's all about this map. Let's go, let's jump to code. So let's go ahead. So here we have our main camera over here, main camera. And uh, this main camera, it's a complex object. So we have here main camera with a script attached to it. So here we have, you know, a camera holder. It's... Uh, so the camera holder is the object here that uh, has... That, you know, this object is apparent for a screen and for... for all the buttons on, on the screen you, you you can see it here so and in fact this is a it's just a plane and you know you can see here the pivot point it's right in its center so I place it cube over here to to make you know this offset for pivot point and now I can rotate it you know normally using this pivot point you know over here yeah I switch it off mesh renderer and box collider, you know, just for uh, m make it work. You know, I don't know, you know, should you 
kill this 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 component or this you no know, I don't kill it you know just for case all right so here we don't have any script attached to uh, you know uh, this you know objects uh, and this we have the script attached to this uh, main camera so he so here we are we have here you know uh, the positions for our cameras, four positions, and this is uh, one of them over here. We have light right, so over here, light left, over here, uh, door button. You can see not uh, door itself, I mean only button. So a right button, right, and yeah, right and left, and at the camera holder. And this is. Uh, I made you know this uh, this checks box for future you know uh, for our uh, enemies in this game. So if we are watching our our uh, TV, so they will be moving. But this is all everything is gonna be in future. So let's just focus on this main script. You know one of the main scripts. So show show hide camera button. So here we have many variables here, and uh, many of them are private because we don't need uh, them you know to be mm, in inspector so we don't need you know to, ch to change them in inspector so and this is about uh, this uh, mouse uh, function so we uh, click uh, mouse button and we uh, have a ray cast over here it's you know like a ray that that is coming from the from the position where we hit our uh, our target with our mouse button and here we have this ray cast over here and if we hit something uh, you know with collider and uh, with name screen button we add the counter you know plus one and here we go so screen counter what happens uh, if you know we get this as zero so it, it, so Basically, uh, when we uh, you know, don't hit uh, this object screen button, we have zero. So, what happens if we have zero? So, if we have zero, and uh, and uh, our rotation of our camera holder is not zero, so um, we start in you know to uh, rotate it. Uh, Within its local, you know, axis. So, if it's you know, for instance, you know, uh, okay. so you know, so it's connected to you know, uh, you know, should we uh, rotate our you know screen or not? So you know, I will uh, hold this for you, you know, to print screen it now and then i will hold for you uh, this to make a print screen now okay and this one so make a print screen of this and of this okay you have it done so so it's about now it's about light so it's about left light and right light so from left side and from right side from left side it's now about door so mm, here we have uh, our door button left and right and we uh, and here we ask our you know mm, uh, the component of these doors you know and it has you know mm, mm, variable uh, open it and if this variable is false, we make it, you know, open it. If it's true, so we close the door. Okay, now we go to door button here. So here we open it. You make a print screen of this, you make it. This is, you know, you don't need it, yeah. It's just in the future, you know, for future. So, 
let's just show you you know the rest of the work so here we have here you know our bear so we don't need it now main camera you saw that so so it's uh, so mm, it's a right side activities and left side activities uh, so what is it so it's everything that you know uh, can be interactive for our gameplay so it's not static object so here we have door right so it has no script at all and uh, here we have door button and uh, light button error so you 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 can see it here so this object has no script attached because uh, everything is done by this script already so you you have seen there you know light button error and now uh, let's focus on this script so door button uh, so this is so, so this one so uh, if we have you know this variable change it to true uh, so uh, our door our door uh, moves um, hmm, I don't know wait it moves down yeah it moves down yeah good mm. oh, really I'm I'm a little bit confused on this you know so basically it works but you know I am a little bit confused you know it should go down or up I made you know test by test so uh, so uh, if we have our door open it and and we change this value so this door is closing if it's it is all closed so we open it and and about you know this value so here we take you know the start start a position of our door where it's in a start so this position and this is a and one end position it's you know a it's you no know, multiplied to four just to make an make offset so and that's all I guess that's all for beginning if you like this video then like it I'm just joking okay I will show you this once again hit play yep so what's my plans about this? My plans is to make a mind for this, for this, for this guy to make it move. So I'm going to make an you know, obvious like this. So, uh, so you have seen this uh, variable we are watching. So uh, I will show you what's happened, you know, uh, behind the scenes. So here we go. We go back to main camera. And we can see here we are watching here. It's false now. We we look at our screen and we are watching. So if we are watching, right, uh, our characters will dis will disappear from here and move somewhere else. Uh, you know, like this. So and also I'm wondering you know, how to use random ranges over here, but it's all in future. Oh, oh, oh. Oh, oh, oh. Okay, that's all people. Thank you for watching. Goodbye. Have a good time. Bye.